Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome back to another episode of the Non-Cooperators. We're continuing with Metal Gear Solid Mobile. Sorry about that on that last episode where I had to... They said you needed the camera, which I opened it up and that shit happened, so... Let's... let's not... Let the, yeah. Not gonna do that again. But I figured out how to, use, how to use this. Basically, just equipped it and then just do this and then watch this. Click and your suit turns to that color. So when you pressed up against, up against it, your camera was like that. So this is actually taking some... It's a mix between Metal Gear Solid 3 with the camo system, how much camo you're in it, and also, like, you know, the, cam the camo percentage, and also from metal from the Octo camo, how your suit mimics it, from Metal Gear Solid uh, 4. So, a lot of inspiration, a lot of coolness in this game. I'll revert back to my classic uh, look. Um, I have to, I have to, I, I can't equip, I can't keep it equipped, because, like I said, it, um, I won't be able to punch anybody. So like I said, there's so many buttons that I do have access to, and, and yet it, I, I, it won't let me uh, use any of them uh, to make my game easier. I gotta do this all difficult. My god, I'm, I'm sweating like crazy, guys. I'm sorry. It's like, ah, so much pressure. Like, I gotta impress all my Metal Gear fans. Because they could probably do this so much better. No, no, no doubt about it that I don't claim to be the best Metal Gear player or anything like that, but I do need to show off some... Uh, skill due to the fact that I don't think this is actually really um um a, 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 what's the word the, the, because the game's not popular or anything like that so I do need to show up something so here I am yay but I'm enjoying it guys I, I hope you guys are enjoying it as well like I said hit that like like button uh, share with some friends if they would if you think they would like this and of course subscribe because I'll definitely do the whole entire Metal Gear franchise definitely leave a comment below on what game you would li like to see me play so. <clears throat> here we go. I'm in the main body of the facility. Where to from here? Dr. Reed says she'll be in the security uh, security control room. Ugh, okay, I had to burp. I'm sorry. I should drink some water, actually. You'll find yourself getting lost along the way. Contact me via the codec and I'll direct you from there, from here. I'm sure it's a lot... Uh, 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 bleh. I can't pronounce any words. I'm sure it's a lot brusher down here. Top floor was just a was just a warm up stick. It's time to get serious. Serious? Aren't you the one who's always telling me to lighten up? Shit! 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 Where's he going? Is he coming towards here? No, he's going that way. Well, he won't be able to see me. Shit! 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 Okay, good. I can I can crouch. Yeah, my camo my camo's down, but he can't see. He's not looking at me though. Go 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 go! Oh, we got a box! Oh, we got a box! Oh, I'm equipping the box! I'm getting the box! Oh, we got you! Gotta love the box! If you don't love the box, how dare you not love the box? Don't see this box! Don't see this box! Don't the box! Touch it! Look at it! It's just a box! It's just a box! It's just a box! It's also very difficult to control because, like I said, no, 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 run, 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 run. It's just a box. It's just a box. It's just a box. <laughs> play this whole entire game all boxedified. <laughs> I don't know. It's very difficult to play it in full box mode. I'm sure it's done. I'm sure like someone's played um, any Metal Gear game full boxified. <laughs> Please, Snake, get here as soon as possible. Put an end to what I've created. Well, technically speaking, it was Revolver Ocelot who put those plans on the market, which makes you only partly to blame. Otacon! <laughs> it's okay, Snake! I know I was not here when I first started working here! <laughs> I didn't see the potential danger in working, and it uh, could lead to... Metal Gear Rex. Yeah, we're talking about Metal Gear Rex. This is actually your fault, Otacon! Metal Gear Rex carries a nuclear payload. Uh, uh, launched Vivala, uh, uh, Vivala, its uh, magnetic railgun delivery uh, delivery s system, making it virtually untrackable. Furthermore, Rex itself is a highly uh, mobile and, uh, and able to launch uh, its warheads from any location of the planet. The country, uh, uh, it's the, uh, the countries it strikes, has no way of knowing where the missiles uh, fired from, and as such, no one, uh, uh, no way of uh, ret retail. Yeah. I should definitely drink some water. In short, Otacon opened up uh, a Pandora's box, and uh, I'm sorry, Ocelot's opened Pandora's box, and we've got to close it. Ellipses. Well, technically, Otacon, you're as much the ah see ha. You're as much to blame as I am. You did. After all, 
helped to develop the original Rex. I realize that, that's why I'm trying to do something to fix this mistake of my past. Ah, we'll check in, we'll check in again soon. Doctor, hold tight. Snake, I've reconnect- I've disconnected Dr. Reed for, uh, for the moment. She can't hear us, uh, hear us. Something you want to tell me? Um, not so sure about her. What do you mean? I can't put my finger on it exactly. But this uh, damsel in distress seems a bit, uh, seems to suit her too well. Otacon, we've got more important things to worry about. I know, I know, just be careful, Snake. We've missed, uh, we're missing a big piece of this puzzle here. I just can't put my finger on it. What's this piece, uh, what this piece is? Okay, so this is gonna be very difficult doing this in the box. Not to mention, I also got to, um, I got that camera to deal with here. I'll equip these rations. What's down here? No, oh, it's broken. Wait, is that broken? Uh, okay, it's broken. What's this? Chaff. I could toss a chaff. If you guys want to see what the chaff looks like here, I'll, I'll try to do, every, uh, do everything once at least. I'll try. Not easy though, but I'm gonna do it. Chaff, toss, and yeah, it just, it just breaks everything up. Armory. Which one's the armory though? Here, wait, wait, wait. Let me just wait for this radar to come back, because I, uh, I just want to see what the armory is. So, fast forward. I'll drink some water. some water. I know the water is red. It's, um, oh shit, that was not the armory. Ah, fuck me, damn it! Ah. Uh, shit, the armory was on the left. I should have guessed. Wait, can I go back, though? Yes, I can go back, okay, good. Uh, the water's red, I know. I use, uh, those Mio's. They're good, it's strawberry watermelon, but it doesn't, it's not actual strawberry, and it's not actual watermelon. It tastes nothing like actual strawberries or watermelon. I hate both of them but I like them as like an artificial flavor. Okay, so let's see what's in this lovely armory. If we can finally get a SOCOM, with a suppressor, some ammunition, anything to help us out. Why, what, what, oh, okay. I need it level three apparently, god damn it. So wait, the fucking lockers don't even have anything? That's bullshit. Not even chaff grenades? Damn it. Yeah, I gotta calm down, guys, because I'm sweating. Whew. All right, let me take that guy out. Wait, is he making a pee pee? Shit. That's a nothing! <laughs> God damn it! Oh, don't you dare, don't you dare. No, don't, don't run away from me! Oh, fuck. Okay, that's it. Uh, back here. No, excuse me! I don't know if this works though. If you go into another room and it just and it just like uh, stops the uh, stops the alert. I'm not too sure though. I never tried it out. Okay. Well, <gasps> nope. Oh, like kind of does. They just they just go on uh, on the caution alert. That's all. Ah, my ears like popped. Okay, we're back to normal. So let me see if I can get this guy one more time. What the fuck? I punched him. I, I punch, punch him. Oh damn you, Cletus Colitis. Yeah, we're gonna go back and forth doing this. I'm sorry, guys. <laughs> Alright, you know what? Fuck him. I don't care. Keep your damn life. I'll break your neck another time when you're not paying attention to yourself in a goddamn mirror. I think that's probably what it is. You can probably see me in the mirror. Well, of course. Oh man. Yeah, this shirt is probably very tight and hot and everything, but yeah. I'm trying to be all Metal gear -ify. I mean, I could go all out. I can definitely wear my, um, my sneaking vest and everything with, um, I actually got an, uh, the Metal Gear, I got the eye patch and, uh, the barrette with, uh, the metal, with, uh, Foxhound logo, Foxhound logo, logo on it. So I could go all out. I'm just looking in. Dun, 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 dun. Yeah. Yeah. And, we're <laughs> and I'm just going through the air vents. I have no idea where this leads me to, honestly. Like I said, this is the first time playing this game. I stopped, yeah, I did stop playing, like, up to this part, so I, I don't, like, around this part, or a little bit before that, but, yeah, it's all new territory. Feet. This is as good as the cutscenes are going to get, by the way. <laughs> like, we're playing on the, on an N-Gage, so, well, an N-Gage, um, uh, app, I think, on this phone. Which I got no complaints. Oop. Hello. 
Snake. What is it, Doc? <laughs> Wait. I know. He's like, what's what's up, Doctor? I mean, it could have it could have just been open for like, what's up, Doc? When when I was a little girl. Oh my God! I don't need to know your goddamn past story. Fine. When I was a little girl, I live to a dark live next to a dark forest at night. I used to lie in bed, head hidden beneath the blankets, terrified that monsters would come out and of the forest and get me. My brother told me I was silly that monsters don't exist, but he was wrong, Snake. Monsters do exist. I've helped create one. Help me set things right. I'm on my way. I'll get you out here. Then we'll put we'll put, uh, put yeah. We'll put then I'll put this facility at Metal Gear out of commission. Apparently not, because there's two more goddamn games after- well, actually... Yeah, there's two more games after this. Metal Gear 2 and Metal Gear Solid 4. Metal Gear Solid 3 happened way before all that, so don't bull don't fucking try to correct me. I'm talking about chronologically. Well, also, you know what? Metal Gear Rising, so 3. I stand corrected. S -s Snake, we need to talk. I'm a little busy here, Otacon. It's important, I'm cutting her off. Snake, I- That's better. This had to be- this, this better be important. I've been doing some digging up. There isn't a single Dr. Reed registered in the, in the uh, scientific organization, Otacon. In case you haven't noticed, this is a black op this is a black ops military research facility. I doubt she's going to be po uh, posting her cover. Uh, yes, I. It's very hard to maintain. I got I got to take a deep breath after every single line. <gasps> yes, but I should be able to dig up something uh, about her. It's like she doesn't exist. Anyway, I'll keep looking, but stay sharp, okay? So, no Dr. Reed. Oh boy. This is gonna be interesting. I don't think the box would actually even help me out. Uh, I'm trying to like see what button to use. Just keep forgetting, like, cause I'm using I'm using too many action buttons. I can use the center button on the actual D-pad. Oh shit. Oh shit, oh shit, oh shit. I'm just, I'm just moving. Oh wait, I can, I can come out of there, can I? Okay, I'm gonna go in there and I'm going to take him out. Or I'm going to, I should, I should definitely try at least. Because he's gonna be a nuisance. I know he, I know he is. But I just want to open up these lockers just to see if there's any, um, any ammo whatsoever. Because like I said, it's gonna be very difficult playing this game. And is the, if the, is the game too quiet? And I, again, I apologize because I've, I've mentioned this before that the game is gonna be very quiet. Because that's just how it is. I don't know. I don't know why it's quiet. And not quiet as in the sniper quiet, because I could definitely... I think here's where it gets a slightly loud. There we go. Yeah, if I fuck off, I'll just beat, uh, beat them up and just uh, run, uh, run behind them and then just take them out like that. Oh, damn you, Cletus Kaleidus. Now the fucking people just keep coming in being like, Oh, you guys there? Mm! Stop calling them! They want to be left alone, they're masturbating in the corner. Seriously, god damn it. I mean, I have to admit, they definitely got smarter by just being like, just call periodically. Damn it. I honestly have no idea where I'm going, guys. <laughs> uh, I don't know where I'm supposed to. They said, it, they said this is going to be a maze, so damn. Fusion laboratory. I don't know if this is where we're supposed to be. Oh, wait. Uh, well, apparently, because I'm not moving this. Or this is probably some place that we could be. Is that a guy holding his penis? I don't know, he's like, he's like that holding his penis. I don't even know. Oh, shit. Steak. It looks like they're installing some sort of color... Reconjuncist? What? Can it be bypassed? Doesn't look like, any, like that. I bet uh, good money that it uses chaff grenades as some kind of set of all kinds of alarms. Hmm. Hmm, indeed. Wait. I think I got it. You can use the camouflage system. Go, uh, go on. It sets your alpha to a specific color, just like the uniform. Exactly, Snake. Just look, just like the uniform. In, uh, in this case, looks like you'll need to be wearing a red uniform. Sample something red to get you past the camera. Oh, okay, I get it. All right, so let me just go through here. I thought it was gonna be like I have to like uh, get um, like a uniform or something like what Raiden did, but no, just use your octocam. Why is 
Why do they even bother putting stuff in this game? Like, that stuff in here when there's no fucking, like, there's nothing in there. Alright, so we're gonna need that. I think that's good. Let me just equip. Wait, do I need to stay equipped on that? Oh, no, I could just, I could just run. Awesome. Uh, that's a metal detector, or laser detector. I don't know. Yeah, infrared sensor. It's on. Damn it. So, what do I do? Uh, oh, chaff grenades. They Hang on. Wait, can, does chaff grenades even... Would chaff grenades work, though? They should. Oh. Okay, it works. Oh... No, I can just pass right there and just wait and just wait for it to uh, come right back. Right? I don't know. I'm gonna drink some water while this uh, thing reboots. See, it worked. Simple problem problem solving. Partly simple. Only sorry. Only only partly. You're gonna ask me, am I gonna go through the whole entire game as a red snake? Uh we'll see. Damn it. No, no, no intruder, no intruder, no intruder. There is no intruder. It's a figment of your goddamn imagination. Shit. Fuck, I fucked up everything. Ah, oh, damn you, Cletus Clytus. Can I go through here? Yeah, you can. Okay, good. Now we escaped. Oh, man, I'm fucking... I probably missed a lot of stuff. Like, the, the spots where they actually do keep stuff is I'm definitely missing it. Temporary... I didn't, I didn't even see that. All right, so we're there in so-and-so mode and caution mode here. You know what? Let me see if I can reset it, though. Let me just go back in here and see what happens. Man, I'm fucking hot. Fusion Laboratory. Is there a node? Ah, whatever. Fuck you. Okay, so we're going to continue this next time on the non-cooperators, and hopefully I can change back into my actual sneaking suit. So we'll see you next time. Where did you come from?